Hi everyone, today we are going to learn about what an e-visa is. So, what actually is an e-visa? An e-visa is a digital record of your immigration status and entry conditions for UK. To access it, you must create a UK VI account. Switching from a physical document to an e-visa won't change your immigration status or entry conditions for UK. In future, you will use an e-visa to travel to UK and won't need a physical document. Just a passport link to your UK VI account. Until the end of 2024, you still need to carry your physical document if you have one. Let us look at the benefits of having an e-visa. They are secure, can't be lost, stolen or tampered with like a physical document. You won't need to wait for or collect a physical document after your application is approved. You might still need to give biometric information in person. It will be faster, easier to show your status at the UK border and share it with employers and landlords. Why UK VI account? UK VI is replacing physical documents with an online record of your immigration status. Creating a UK VI account is free of cost. How to use UK VI account? After creating your UK VI account, you can view your e-visa details online, including your permission type, expiration date, and stay conditions. You can update your contact details in your UKVI account. Your e-visa will be linked to your passport in your UKVI account. Keep your passport details updated in your account and inform them of any changes. You still need to carry your current passport. If you've reported a new passport and are waiting for your UKVI account to be updated, carry your old passports too, if possible, to avoid delays at the border. How to use UKVI account? To share your immigration status with others like employees or landlords, generate a time limited share code in the view and proof service. You can create a new code anytime and don't need to remember a single one. Your immigration status will be automatically shared with some government departments and public authorities, reducing the need for you to use online services to prove your status. How to get an e-visa and a UKVI account? Now this is if you have biometric residence permit. If your VIP expires on 31st December 2024, create a UKVI account now to access your e-visa before your VIP expires. Continue to carry your VIP when traveling internationally until it expires. Keep your expired VIP card for future UK applications and personal records. If you've lost your VIP card, use your passport or visa application reference number to create your UK VI account. Request a replacement VIP only if it's lost, stolen and you have no other ID for your UK VI account. If you have permission to stay in the UK, create a UK VI account to sign in and access your e-visa through the view and group service. How to apply for an e-visa? First, before you start, you will need access to a smartphone, a mobile phone number, an email address and your VRP card. Click on, click on this link given below to start the application process. Fill up the details, create a UKVI account. Let us look at the fifth step. You will receive an email from the home office. Log in to the UKVI account from the link received in the email. Download and install the application known as UK Immigration ID Check. Scan your VIP card through the application. You will have to complete three tasks in order to link your UK visa to your account. The first one is identity and contact, second account security, third submit request. Under identity and contact, it includes face recognition, phone number and email ID. Under account security, you will be asked three security questions. To submit request, there will be a declaration. The application request will be submitted. Wait for the confirmation email and view your e-visa. That's all about e-visa.
follow us at Joy University Overseas Education for more further information.